This is chapter six, problem number two. All right, so here's a hammer. So let's say you have a hammer. The hammer is 1.2 kilogram. Okay, so that's about 2.5 pounds. All right, so is above the nail that is over here. Let's say there's a nail. We try to put the nail into the wood. Okay, so this distance is about 0 0.5 meter. Okay, what is the maximum amount of work would it do to the nail? Okay, so what is our magical formula? It is work, it is equal to force times distance. If it moves, in a constant velocity. If it's not accelerating, that means the force, there's nothing going up over here, so I should not draw this one up. Okay, so there is only one force. Okay, and let's assume that it moves at a constant velocity. If you let it free fall, what will happen? If you let it free fall, then it will accelerate, okay? Well, we can still calculate it, okay? Later on in this chapter, when you learn about potential energy, then we can calculate it. All right, let's now assume that this is the only force, and if we control it, let it move, and move down in a constant velocity, okay? So that force is the mg force. m is equal to, oh, well, m times g, and the D distance is moving by 0 0.5 meter. Okay, so M is 1.2 times G is 9.8 times 0 0.5 meter. And that would be equal to 1.2 times 9.8 times 0 0.5, 5 5.88 joule, which is very little. Okay. So the question asks, why do people not just let it fall, but add their own force to the hammer? So you can let it just fall down and hit the hammer. That's one way. Or when your hand is over here, you, you can add more force to it. Okay. Well, I'm not sure whether all the people would, would not let it fall. I'm sure some of them will just allow it to fall. Okay. Or sometimes you have to leave it up so you don't touch the nail with that high force. It depends on what you're doing, okay? In my opinion, one of the reason is because this one, this distance is only zero point, around 0 0.3 meters. So first of all, it's not, the radius is not enough to hit it. So you have to add some, you have to hold it some way. And usually this is a big nail or some type of nail getting into wood and you may need to add more force to it because only uh, 5.8 joule is not enough for a nail to get in. The lucky number for this problem is 4. 4 is your lucky number for this problem.